is Friday, so it's time to check back in with those red cattle cast numbers and what we're seeing across our area. The Salvation Armies in Green Bay and the Fox Cities, our totals are now up to $1.3 million, just over $1.3 million. The overall goal, $2.5 million, so we are over halfway achieving that goal with about a week left. Yeah, nice. we've got our work cut out for yeah, us. Yeah, we got to so. make up some ground. Yeah. All right. All right, Ryan, we got more from the Salvation Army mm -hmm. as well tonight. Yeah, in fact, we can show you tonight the impact of your donations with the start of the Green Bay Salvation Army's Christmas distribution. Local 5's Danielle Zokowski shows us how it is quietly changing families' lives. I'm a single parent, so I get to let my son enjoy Christmas just like everyone else. At this quiet and unassuming storefront at Bayside Marketplace, the Salvation Army has gathered over 100 volunteers and countless donations to make sure 1,500 families in the Green Bay area have food on the table and presents under the tree when Christmas morning rolls around. Well, this is the Salvation Army's Christmas distribution. We have partnered with businesses, with the Toys for Tots campaign, with the Give a Kid a Book campaign to make sure that we have toys and books. We even have food baskets. Brooke Dennis says sometimes she struggles as a single parent, and these gifts will make Christmas for her two-year-old son, Josiah. When I um, heard about this, I was so excited that he was going to be able to experience Christmas like I did when I was growing up, and he's going to freak out. Volunteers say helping at this event is something they look forward to all year. I feel happy. This is one of my favorite things to do all year. I really do look forward to this, so I'm just happy and blessed that I'm able to give back. And this Christmas season, shoppers and volunteers alike remind us all giving back where you can is the most important part of the holidays. I'm thankful for the community that they do something like this, and hopefully as the years go on, I'll be able to contribute and volunteer and help because to help other families. In Green Bay, Danielle Zolkowski, Local 5 News. Nan Paul from the Salvation Army says each child gets two presents, books and a game, stuffed animal, and a box of food for the entire family. The Salvation Army is still looking for volunteer bell ringers for their Christmas giving campaign. This is the final week that the Red Kettles will be out at businesses across northeastern Wisconsin. If you're interested in becoming a bell ringer, head over to registertoring.com. You can sign up for a location and a time that works best with your schedule.